I'm your Fox 47 neighborhood reporter, Daria Sudris. We've shown you conditions at Jackson County jails. The sheriff and deputies say they are dangerous and deplorable, which is why they are asking voters to approve funding for a new facility and improvements. But not everyone is convinced of the need. If these were safety issues and they were not passing uh, inspections, this complex would have been shut down. Scott Ogney, who is running for Jackson County Sheriff, questions the narrative behind the pro-millage campaign. In particular, the emphasis on the condition of the Wesley Street Jail. Apparently it's passing inspection. Jackson County Administrator Michael Overton confirmed to me that, to his knowledge, the jail has not been cited by inspectors. That's because, according to Overton, the county has kept up on building repairs and maintenance. On August 6th, Jackson County taxpayers will be asked to approve a millage to fund improvements, including enlarged new facilities on Chanter Road, as well as ongoing operations at Jackson County jails. If approved, it would mean a mill of 0 0.9, which would cost an owner of a $200,000 home about $90 per year. Proponents point to the Wesley Street Building's age and condition. Opponents question the need for new construction and suggest other funding sources or a smaller millage. County Commissioner Corey Kennedy, who sat on an ad hoc county committee that evaluated the condition of the facility, didn't want to speculate on what would happen if the millage fails. But he says, We explored renovating the old facility on Wesley Street. Unfortunately, that's cost prohibitive. Ogney isn't convinced a replacement is needed just yet. I think many things are repairable. And the costs, he says, are not insignificant. Uh, the amount of money that they want to moving the sheriff's offices and the central jail out to the north campus is a significant commitment to a lot of people that are struggling right now. It's less expensive to build on to the Chanter Road facility and move all operations out there. In your neighborhood, I'm Daria Sudris, Fox 47 News.